I got my ring and I ring and I got my shit in double yes! Hello motherfuckers, welcome back to motherfucking channel. Today I'm going to react to Megan Thee Stallion, Hot Girl Summer featuring Nicki Minaj and Ty dollar sign bitch bitch i've been waiting for this all fucking year like i can't even fathom when i first heard she did megan did a freestyle like two years ago and she was like a lot of these niggas want to hit it with maggie he heard i uh, work it like ever since then i low-key been a stand like i just wanted her to put out more music something that like an album or an ep like or i don't think that was you i think it was a mixtape um what is that called? What is that even called? I don't know, but all the songs in there are fucking amazing. And she's really taking over the summer. Then you add the queen of motherfucking hip hop herself, Nikki, the king of choruses, Ty Dolla Sign. Bitch, we have a hit on our hands. I haven't heard this yet. It's literally the next day. This dropped last night. It is currently 522 Friday. 522 Friday. And, bitch, I've been trying to duck and bob these fucking, like, snippets, all that. I cannot fucking wait. But, when I heard Sex Talk by Megan at the beginning of this year, I said, she's coming. And she's coming hard. Like, she has her own sound. She has a good, really good fucking delivery. And she raps. Like, she fucking raps, but makes it sound fun. And she get, she was really giving me Nicki vibes, because that's what Nicki does. She... She's a rapper, but, like, she can play on it and, like, have fun with it. So, I know this is going to be good. Let's get into this before I start. Please like and fucking subscribe. And let's go. Okay, I got to play it on this speaker right here because loud, and I want to hear it good the first time. Whoa! Oh, this is the snippet that we've all been hearing all week. handle me oh I heard this snippet too it's number one on trending heavy head did she say Drake she said don't tell them where I'm at or don't tell them you with me when they ask where you at heavy Yo. This song is crazy. Like, I wish I could turn it up louder, but my songs keep getting, my videos keep getting uh, copyrighted. Nikki. Hold on. Hey! Ah! Stay! Come on! I got my ring and I ring and I got my shit in double, yes! <gasps> yes! Woo! Bitch! Yes! Fuck! See you guys, I cannot stop, I can't with this. Oh my god. Holy shit. Oh, is Megan like singing? Wow, oh, this is a vibe, y'all. This is a fucking vibe. Thank God for that live that they did. <gasps> Nikki. Oh, God. Wow. Is it over? What? Oh my god. I can't feel my motherfucking feet right now. I'm really shook. I, I have a 
lot to say, but like, I don't know what to say certainly about Nicki's verse because anytime new Nicki music comes out, and I'm like reacting to it, or even like if I'm not reacting to it, I just listen to it on my own time, which happens, which has happened these last couple times that she's dropped like features or whatever. I just listen to it on my own time. I do not catch nothing Nikki's saying just because there's a vibe, there's a flow, and there's a vibe that I just love to catch. Like once I catch that and I see how she's like riding the beat then I can start focusing on the lyrics and stuff. And she's literally the only person that I do that with. Like, I don't know what it is, but I just know, because it's very like, I don't know. But this was fucking everything. I'm so glad they linked up. I think this is Nikki's best feature or best collaboration with a female rapper. She has Motorsport with Cardi. She has Bats with Trina. Oh my God, she's done two female rap collabs this year. Shit, bitch. And this was, this is, I mean, for me personally, this is my favorite one. I, I'm sorry, Babs is really good. It even has two verses, but this right here just feels so great. It feels so, there's so many things that this is going to accomplish. And like, it's literally the first ever female co rap collaboration that hit number one on US iTunes, which is, let's give it up. That's iconic, it's iconic. Oh my God. I hope this makes it, I mean, it should, like, is this gonna make it on her next album? I don't know. But Nikki did her thing, Megan did her fucking thing. They both, they matched each other's energies, which was, well, Nikki recorded this after the song was already, like, recorded, so. Nikki matched Megan's energy and that's, what a great collaboration is right there. Like, if you can match that person's energy, the original artist's energy on the song, then it's, it, it just sounds better. It sounds better, it sounds more genuine. This was everything I love, their friendship. Nikki X Mag. Bitch. Bitch, I'm pretty shook. I'm sorry, <laughs> I'm just like really shook. I'm sweating and shit. Damn. And let's talk about the fucking cover art. Oh my fucking God. It's so like simple. Nikki has the pink hair. Megan has the black hair with the cowboy hat on because that's Megan's like theme. And you know what? Old dude, what's his name? Um, Old Town Road Boy. He like, I don't want to say stole it, but when those two first came out at the beginning of this year, they didn't come out at the beginning of this year, but... They both popped off at the beginning of this year. And they both had that cowboy, cowgirl, like, style. And it was just, like, I don't like it for him, but I like it for her. I think he needs to change that up. But, I mean, hey, I don't know. I just hope Megan and Nikki continue to give us something because that was everything. I fucking love that so much. But I guess it's it, you guys. Make sure you like and subscribe and let me know how you feel about this song. And the video, oh my God, there's gonna be a video. I know there's gonna be a video. I'm gonna have to react to that. But I guess that's it, you guys. Make sure you like and subscribe. Bye, motherfucker.